Welcome back to our channel. Today's video is all about a topic that has been gaining a lot of attention lately. Semen retention. We'll explore how this practice can improve your masculinity by leaps and bounds, and why it's worth giving a try. So, get comfortable, hit that play button, and let's dive into the fascinating world of semen retention. The modern guy is not known for his reliability in following through on plans. No ordinary man ever thinks ahead. Men, in general, lack drive and ambition in modern society. Nowadays, the normal man is someone you definitely don't want to be because he'll get washed away with the rest of the ship. Here's a little secret. Keeping your sperm in your body can increase your manliness by a factor of 10. Most of the women in the room automatically think of that phrase when I say it. Just what does that signify? What this implies is that you allow the sentence to spark your creativity. I'm going to be a real manly man, an actual man's man. Eventually, I will rise to the level of king, and men will bow down to me, while women will wait in long lines simply to be with me. You see, it has all the makings of a fantastic film or TV series, but obviously, you don't reside there. You are a part of the actual world, the manly world, where you now reside. In what way does the expression reflect reality? The truth behind that term requires an appreciation for masculinity on your part. Just what does being a man mean to you? When you're a man, you know your A and B, where you are and where you're going, and then the sequence of events that will occur to bring about your arrival. You don't shrink and run away in the face of adversity either. The interruptions don't get to you. Instead, you keep your eyes on the prize with blinders on and make it to point B, which is your end destination, which is your vision. Do you see what I'm trying to say? Hence, if I say that maintaining your sperm count will increase your masculinity by a factor of 10, I mean it. So what does that entail? That implies that it's going to allow you to be aware of everything that's on around you. Because in order to successfully journey anywhere, you have to have a beginning point. When you input a destination into your phone's or computer's GPS, it will first ask you where you are. Because knowing where you are now is essential to making progress in the right way. Hence, while semen retention is elevating your masculinity to level 10, you'll be acutely aware of your current status. Many men refuse to be honest with themselves in order to get perspective. Surely, everyone wants to be honest with themselves, right? For one, they'd have to tell themselves some very painful facts if they were to tell themselves the whole truth. What can I do with my life? I'm big, I'm a loser, I'm broke, I don't attract any good-looking women, and I'm a complete and utter waste of space. People need to have these honest conversations with themselves, since admitting one's limitations is a necessary first step toward gaining access to more promising opportunities. Many people avoid being honest about their circumstances since doing so would force them to face unpleasant truths about themselves. And when you have to confront your reality, the only way you're going to make it to the other side is if you're continually taking action. If you're researching, if you're trying to comprehend these things, and I stated at the outset that most guys don't do this. Most guys lack direction, are unmotivated, lack ambition, and lack self-assurance. They don't have the tools necessary to succeed on the other side and they'll continue to let the realization that they lack those tools prevent them from attempting. Thus, they will be unable to realize any benefits associated with developing traits, associated with masculinity, because they haven't gotten beyond the first hurdle. Having faith in oneself, it will eventually reach zero. Seems trite because it's a cliche. But the reason it's trite is that it's such an undiscovered truth. You need confidence in yourself before you can do anything. Now, hear this. Once you've been honest with yourself, once you've come to trust or believe in yourself, and once you've grasped your current situation, the next crucial step is to choose your ultimate destination. What do you hope to accomplish with your life? This is the complete thing, and when I say vision, 
I mean anything from a broad perspective to a narrow one. I don't want to give the impression that everything is too much to handle since it's not. In fact, this is the boring bit. Just putting it all on paper is the simple part. The true challenge is maintaining consistency. Although the answers to your concerns are straightforward, putting them into action is often where people run into trouble. To that end, hear me out. You found it out because semen retention heightened your consciousness, allowing you to finally look yourself in the eye and speak the truth. Now that you know where you are, your point A, you can focus on identifying your desired destination. When confronted with an idea, many men just don't know where to begin. Our framework is based on the Personal Development 2.0 concept, which considers all aspects of one's life, including physical well-being, financial security, meaningful connections with others, and meaningful contributions to society. This is the starting point for developing a plan for your health if you don't already have one. Exactly how do you envision your ideal state of health? It is here that you should begin if you have no plan for your financial future. How would you like it to appear? Where did you two begin dating? How would you like it to appear? Which is it exactly? For what purpose does that pave the way? If you could describe its appearance, what would you say? It's enough to have your footing solid when you're just getting started. Those who are used to it and proficient multitaskers don't need to employ the all-force approach. So, for the moment, consider yourself to be at square one. To provide an example, if you're finally ready to take charge of your health, you finally have a plan. For the sake of argument, let's pretend that your goal is to become physically powerful. After you know what it is you want, the next step is to determine how you will achieve that goal. For example, if you want to become more powerful, you will need to figure out what steps you will need to do to achieve that goal. The time has come for you to educate yourself. Read up on the human body. You need to educate yourself on attrition, exercise, mobility, and flexibility immediately. And so you must study. Study angles and this other stuff, right? That's what occupies your time. This is what you should be getting out for bed every morning. And here's where a lot of my listeners drop off the radar. It's important to note that, to begin with, the ordinary guy is completely out of it. I can't stress this point enough. Keeping a diary is essential to success in any endeavor. Please allow me to restate that. Well, now we get it. This is all just your point A. It's important to note that where you are at this time, consider yourself to be point A. Tell yourself the truth, even if it hurts, since you can't expect other people to be honest if you aren't honest with yourself. Thus, you start by noting down your starting location, and then you record your ultimate aim and ultimate vision. To put it another way, that's your point B, and I want you to go to C. In the midst of all that, we must record this strategy. In order to put together a strategy, you need to start with the correct components. Be sure you have all the required components before beginning construction. You realize you need to improve your health once you learn about the current resources available for doing so. That's why I've decided to train hard and bulk up. I think it's clear that you'll need to study the several topics I've just listed. The research will be required for the strength training program, the need for mobility, and so on. To top it all, it drives me nuts that many men simply refuse to do it. Not that they lack the ability to do so, but rather that they lack the motivation to do so due to their perception that it is difficult. And I was like, dude, you always have a supercomputer with you so you can spy on anyone. Check out the latest strength building videos on TikTok, Instagram, YouTube, or any other platform. If you can spare half an hour to an hour to scroll, you will be light years ahead of the competition. As a result, you dive right into the process. Each time you put in the effort, you're getting closer to being the greatest you possible. As a result, you're gaining this knowledge. You're setting aside time every day, maybe 20 minutes, 40 minutes, or an hour to work on this objective. Here, you lay the groundwork for future structure. So now you need a routine if you want to conduct the activities reliably and efficiently. A routine is simply a collection of habits, and habits are only recurring behaviors. 
Hence, if you want to make improvements to your health, a regular part of your life, you must learn what steps to take to achieve this goal. Staying motivated toward your goals is essential for fulfilling your inner purpose and embracing the practice of semen retention. When you set clear targets and work towards their realization, you develop the confidence and discipline necessary to succeed. As you remain committed to your goals, you can achieve a sense of purpose and fulfillment that can help you feel more masculine and empowered. Semen retention is also closely linked to motivation and goal setting. By preserving your vital energy, you can harness it towards achieving your objectives and reaching new levels of success. This practice can help you feel more focused, determined, and driven toward fulfilling your aspirations. Overall, staying motivated toward your goals is a crucial component of both personal growth and semen retention. By cultivating a strong sense of purpose and following through on your plans, you can unlock your full potential and achieve your most significant aspirations. What do you think, guys? Will you start your journey today? Comment down your answers below. Don't forget to like this video. And since you're already here, you might as well subscribe to our channel and click on the notification bell so you don't miss out on great new videos. Thank you for watching, and we will see you in the following video.